Moore's empirical law states that number of components on a single chip doubles every two years at a minimal cost. Cerebrus Systems is an AI company uh, builds computer systems for complex artificial intelligence deep learning applications. They announced wafer scale engine WS3, third version of the chip, the fastest high performance computing and world's largest AI chip. The chip is packed with 4 trillion transistors comparing with NVIDIA H100, 2 trillion transistors. And again, it is 46.2 millimeter squared silicon packed with 900,000 cores optimized for sparse linear algebra. This chip is developed using 5 nanometer Taiwan semiconductor manufacturing process. 125 petaflops of AI compute, 44 gigabytes of on-chip memory, 21 petabytes of memory bandwidth, and 214 petabit of fabric bandwidth. This dinner plate sized AI chip, Cerebrus claims the chip is twice the performance per watt of its predecessor, alongside a collaboration with Qualcomm aimed at accelerating machine learning inferencing. The Cerebrus CS3 is designed to accelerate the latest large AI models. Big AI needs big memory. In a GPA-based cluster, that means using expansive high bandwidth memory, HBM modules, and 3D chip stacking. CS3 is a generational leap for AI inference and training. It is 2x performance improvement, same power, and the price offering is same with that price point. You have double exponent for the same workload again. Here is another Cerberus cluster shot with the Supermicro 1U servers. Cerberus generally uses AMD EPYC for higher core counts, but perhaps also because of a lot of the Cerebrus team came up came from C Micro, which was acquired by AMD. In addition to AI workloads, the combined technologies from HPE and Cerebrus will also be considered for more traditional HPC workloads in support of larger memory intensive modeling and simulation needs. CS3 is packing with more tr transistors to run the workloads and compare to NVIDIA H100 uh, computer systems. And if you look at CS3 got a lot more offerings for to run AI workloads. In a AI world, uh, training the models using high performance computing is the vital infrastructure. So Cerebrus climbs to train Llama large language model using CS3 cluster. It just takes one day to train the model. Whereas if you take the train same model, GP cluster takes more than a month to train. Yeah, that's, that's crazy in terms of training that huge volume of data. Unlike GPUs, Cerebrus wafer scale clusters decouple computer and memory components, allowing easily scale up memory capacity in memory X units. The single CS3 can be paired with a single 1.200 petab terabytes memory X unit, meaning that single CS3 rack can store more model parameters than 10,000 node GPU cluster. Cerebrus mentioned their website about the only AI supercomputer that looks programs like a single device. CS3 will be built in Dallas, Texas and comes online Q2 2024. Cerebrus has partnered with Qualcomm to develop a joint AI platform for training and inference. WS3 wafer scale engine 3 is a game changer for the massive scale AI model training and inferences.